and gentlemen, thank you for joining us this afternoon. Our program will begin momentarily, but before we begin, we'd like to make a few announcements. At this time, please be sure to silence your electronic devices as to avoid any disruption to the program. Your cooperation is greatly appreciated. We would also like to take this time to recognize all those who contributed to our new uniform drive, thanks to the incredible amount of donors who you will see listed on the inside of your program. We were able to order the great new uniforms in time for our home opener this season. Any donor who may be in attendance with us today, thank you for your contribution to our program. Your support made our new uniforms possible. Let's uh, recognize them. We would also like to thank all of you, band, parents, and families, whether you volunteered in our concession stands, announced, served as a chaperone, or simply made time in your schedule to bring and pick up your students to and from rehearsal, run them down to metronome music for lessons or repairs, or coming to their performances like this one. Thank you for your support to this program and to your students. Thank you again for being with us today. Please take your seats as the performance is about to begin.
ladies and gentlemen, please rise as we honor America with the playing and singing of our national anthem. the rest of our directing staff, please welcome to the stage Associate Director Mr. Mike Grady and Assistant Director Mr. Tim Meyer. And now for the people you really came to see, uh, allow me to introduce to you the 2015 Shelby Whippin Marching Band. By class, we'll begin with our freshmen. Freshmen, please rise. Let's have a hand for Next, our sophomores. Sophomores, please rise. Thank you, sophomores. You may be seated. Now, getting into our upperclassmen. Juniors, please rise and be recognized. Thank you, juniors. And last but certainly not least, I'd like to introduce the members of our senior class. Seniors, when you hear your name, please stand and be recognized. Ali Uplinger. Andy Wiggins, Andy McKinney, Ben White, Hannah Stone, Jacob Beers, who is not with us yet, Jason Dick, Caitlin Hawkins, Macy Sloan, Matt Dawson, Nate Emerson, Noah John, Robert Moore, Tyler Sexton, and our final senior, who is an exchange student joining us this year from Spain, and who made the incredible effort to learn a whole new instrument, learn trombone this year, just to play in our band, Sarah Diaz Cortez. Thank you, seniors, for your years of dedication and experience. You may be seated. Introduce the band to you by section. First, the sousaphones, the lowest voice in our band. Next, slide trombones add brilliance and power. is covered by our mellophones. The trumpets complete the upper voice of our brass section. The tenor saxophones begin as our lowest voice of the woodwinds. Then 
They are accompanied by their upper counterparts, the alto saxophones. <laughs> Clarinets add this sweet sound. Flutes and piccolos provide the highest voice of the band. Snare drums, bass drums, cymbals, and toms. No band is complete without a percussion section. together piece by piece and it sounds like this. Gentlemen, your 2015 Shami Whippet Marching Band. And now on for halftime. Throughout this season, we played a number of Greeks and popular hits, uh, beginning with this song by a group called Follow Up Away. This song is called Century. We featured our majorettes as well as our drum lines to this next tune. Please welcome Mr. Gradium to the podium as the band performs Taylor Swift's Shake It Off.
this recent Disney movie took the world by storm, or at least by snowstorm. Please welcome Mr. Meyer to the podium as the band performs Let It Go from Disney's Frozen. Back to the Future Day. 
Uh, for those who may not have seen the Back to the Future films or may not understand, Wednesday, October 21st, 2015, was the date to which the main characters Marty McFly and Dr. Emmett Brown traveled forward to in their time-traveling DeLorean. Now, according to the movie, the year 2015 was meant to be filled with flying cars, hoverboards, uh, auto-fitting clothing, and World Series victory by the Chicago Cubs. Uh, unfortunately, that was a disappointment to many people. Uh, those predictions did not come true, and yet, regardless, we celebrated this landmark in cinema history by performing a halftime show dedicated to the mu music featured in Back to the Future. We start off as Marty McFly races through town on his skateboard to Huey Lewis's Power of Love. Please welcome back to the podium, Mr. Mike Grady. at his mother and father's high school dance, trying to unite the two in love, lest he and his family become unwritten out of history. Welcome Mr. Meyer back to the podium as we ignite love with the sweet sounds of Earth Angel.
now moving on to the next part of our program. In our own history, there have come times when powers from beyond our shores have attempted to break our way of life, our bonds, and our spirits. The events of September 11, 2001 remain among the most horrific of such events in recent memory. The year, this year on the anniversary of that fateful day, the Shelby Whip Band performed a show dedicated not only to the lives lost that day, but also to the strength and spirit that we found together as Americans, as a nation united as one.
Kids, they've been working on that all year long, and I'm glad they had a good performance of it just now. Good job, percussion. <laughs> at, uh, at this time, I would like to recognize some of the outstanding members of our band. First, I'd like all of our band manager, uh, managers to stand and be recognized. All of our managers, who include our secretaries, our librarians, media coordinators, and equipment managers, and have had an important role in our, our organization and the operation of our band program this year. Please stand and be recognized. Thank you, managers. Next, I'd like to recognize our leadership team. We've had an incredible year of marching band, and much of, much of the credit must go to our section and squad leaders. So, introducing from our flute section, Caitlin Hawkins and I, Abby Lieberger. From the clarinets, Catherine Davis and Emily Shepard. From the saxophones, Anna Stone and Annie McKinney. The trumpets Morgan Hummel, Lexi Hurst, and Connor Lamb. From our metaphones, Finley Means. From our trombones, Andy Wiggins, Carly Engel, and Brooke Hostetter. From our sousaphones, Noah John. From the percussion section, Michael Meyer and Jacob Holloway. And our majorettes, Allie Uplinger and Bailey White. Thank you, squad leaders, for your dedication and hard work throughout the marching season. You guys are greatly appreciated. Let's give them another round of applause. Thank you, squad leaders. You may, you may be seated. Before we move on to the last part of our program, I'd like to take a moment here to reflect on the loss of an incredible leader in the world of music education. Dr. John R. Woods, who passed away on September 12, 2015. Now, many of you might recognize the name Dr. John Woods as a former director of the Ohio State University Marching Band. However, his work as an educator branches far out, much farther than the realms that we in Ohio know as Buckeye Nation. As a director of bands and as a professor of music education, Dr. Woods' teachings, lessons, and innovations have influenced and inspired music educators and musicians of all ages all around the country and all throughout the world. Such inspiring figures can have an amazing impact on one's life. And this is why we feel it is important to recognize inspiration within our own program. So now I would like to present a new award for the Shelby Whippet Band. Unlike other awards that we'll be presenting later in the school year, the award for the most inspirational bandsman is unique in that its recipient is chosen by the members of the band without any deciding influence from any of us on the directing staff. The band members were instructed to nominate students who they feel have been an inspiration to them, whether through their leadership, their musicianship, 
dedication, camaraderie, or any other inspiring qualities. The band therefore nominated these 12 students as our finalists for the most inspirational bandsmen. These finalists are Allie Geis, Andy Wiggins, Annie McKinney, Brooke Hostetter, Emily Shepard, Finley Means, Hannah Stone, Caitlin Hawkins, Kristen Long, Lexi Hurst, Michael Meyer, and Morgan Hummel. Let's have a hand for our finalists for most of the It is now my great pleasure to announce our winner, the 2015 Most Inspirational Bandsman, as selected by the Shelby Whippet Band, is Michael Meyer. close our concert with the Shelby High School alma mater and fight song of the Red and Gray. The words for both can be found on the back page of your program.
so much for joining us this afternoon. We hope you enjoy the concert and hope you enjoy the rest of your weekend. Thank you again for coming out and supporting our students. Thank our directors for a great emergency.